Got a report of a hit-skip accident at Dryden in 75. Moraine police responded to the crash Wednesday afternoon. Witnesses saw four men run from the scene. Two of them went to this marathon nearby. Uh, where they approached the victim who was uh, sitting in the parking lot. Um, they indicated that they had a weapon, uh, presumably a handgun. One of the suspects told the victim to open the door and drive, and she wouldn't get hurt. Uh, a witness followed the, uh, the vehicle into uh, Dayton and notified our dispatch what was going on. The car ended up in Dayton, where the suspects jumped out and kept running near Broadway and Edwin C. Moses. Thomas Crawford was caught and arrested at the scene. He's charged with aggravated robbery, kidnapping, stolen property, and cited for the crash. Police are still looking for the driver of the car, a black male believed to be in his mid-30s or early 40s with a pierced ear, goatee, and a leather coat with purple patches on it. But that's kind of a rare circumstance. That's crazy. Jesse King was surprised to hear it happened in broad daylight. Not down here. Not at this gas station. Moraine police say the witnesses who followed after the carjacking were a big help in catching Crawford and that the victim did the right thing by complying with the suspects. Um, if you feel your life's in, in danger, obviously comply with, uh, with whatever you're being told. Um, and try to get out as quickly as possible, as safely as possible.